Hey you guys and welcome back to another video I miss you guys so much but if you are new to this channel I am Alexis this is sexy Lexi Inc okay you are a sexy Lexi babe so thank you for watching make sure you tell a friend and tell a friend to subscribe to sexy Lexi Inc make sure you shop with my business because my lashes and my lip gloss is from sexy Lexi Inc of course so you can visit my website in the description if you want to support your girl but I I have not posted in two weeks you guys and that is crazy I miss you guys so much and I was like you know they've been wanting me to do wholesale my two-year business anniversary is coming up yeah. clap it up clap it up round of applause thank you thank you my two-year business is coming up March 13th so I knew that I wanted to be able to release some wholesale glosses for my special day so in today's video we are finally gonna be making some wholesale lip gloss and I'm finally gonna be using this right here my lip gloss filling machine I have not used it since I got it and I got it on Christmas so I'm very excited I have let me show you guys my little tools and utensils that I have for today so as you can see I have this cake batter hand mixer thing that I'm going to be using since I don't have a kitchen aid just yet I do have my 12 pound ready gloss gloss base ready to go because we need this. this is the best lip gloss base ever you can find it on my amazon store if you want to try it i do have this big bowl that i am going to use to make the gloss in and my lip gloss filling machine so as i just showed you guys i have my lip gloss base my lip gloss filling machine my little cake batter mixer thingy and my mixing bowl so the first lip gloss that we are going to make for wholesale is of course brown skin girl brown skin girl skin just like pearls the best thing in the world i wouldn't trade you for anybody else say eh? i probably said that all wrong but yes brown skin girl is my most popular lip gloss so that is the first gloss that we are going to be making and using with my lip gloss filling machine and i will be behind the scenes recording and taking pictures and all of that so i can post it on my youtube or post it on my instagram and promote you know gotta promote gotta get that product pictures all of that i might even show you guys how i edit it um whew, i don't know why i'm out of breath but i might I might also show you guys how I edit on my pictures because y'all have been asking me to do that too. So I'll probably put that in this video as well. But I'm going to go ahead and grab my little baggies that I'm going to put the lip gloss in. And they look like this. Okay, and I have my stickers right here as well. Okay. So now it's time to get into the aesthetic, get into the nice little quality of the video, and let's get right to it. So before we get started, of course, I'm going to go ahead and put on my gloves to protect myself from the gloss and to protect the gloss from me as well. So now I'm going to go ahead and pour a nice amount of gloss base into the bowl. I'm kind of eyeing it and I will bring out my scale to weigh it as well just so I can get an idea of how much gloss base I am putting inside of this bowl. So obviously I need more gloss base than this to fill five eight ounce pouches of gloss that I'm trying to do. So I'm going to go ahead and add some more ready gloss to our bowl. that I'm happy with the amount of gloss base that I have inside of my bowl I'm gonna go ahead and add our chocolate brown lip liquid from TKB trading and our spice chocolate flavoring oil from TKB trading as well 
Now, since this lip gloss is already pigmented normally, I wanted to make sure I had a lot of pigment in this bowl because this is more gloss based, which means I need more pigment and more flavoring oil. So you want to make sure you add a generous amount of brown lip liquid if you are trying to recreate this or do wholesale yourself. But I'm just showing you guys the process because I know you guys were waiting for me to start this and are super excited and looking forward to it just as much as me. I'm gonna go ahead and insert my hand mixer so that we can really get this pigment and flavoring oil all intertwined with our gloss base. Six hours later. So after mixing and mixing and mixing, I still want to make sure that I mixed it good. So here I am with a metal spoon. Oh, and there's my ring light falling. <laughs> but I'm still trying to make sure that I mixed it all good together. I, even with the mixer, I just want to make sure that I have it nice and pigmented like normal. I just want to make sure everything is good. So yes, that's what I'm doing right now. So like I told you guys, I wanted to show you some behind the scenes of what I do behind the camera. So right now I'm just setting my phone up so I can take some good product pictures and product videos and just show everybody me um, basically going through the whole wholesale process because my customers really like seeing behind the scenes content. So I'm just letting you guys get a little insider on that in this video. So now for the fun part, I'm gonna go ahead and add our gloss base to the lip gloss machine so we can start filling up our wholesale pouches. Next, I'm going to go ahead and add my Sexy Lexi ink labels to the pouches so that way I can have that already ready so that when I feel it, it's done and good to go.
so at this point i have my camera rolling i'm super excited to finally try this lip gloss filling machine and i'm starting to fill the pouch and then i realize um some water came out with it on the first try so obviously i cannot sew this first patch of, or pouch of gloss um brown snake girl gloss because it had water in it so i just wanted to keep it real with you guys and show you um what was going on because i did clean the machine before so i guess it was still some water in there and it got in this first pouch so i just ended up moving on and trashing that pouch and continue on with the other ones and that is what i'm doing right now to make sure it was eight ounces of gloss base in here and that is what i measure out perfectly so this is how each of the brown skin girl wholesale pouches should look You guys this is a lot harder than i thought look what i did to my shirt i got all that lip gloss on my shirt like what i did not think that using that machine was gonna be that hard i washed it and it's still water in it but i washed it so long ago like i can't believe it hasn't evaporated out so in the first little um bag i tried to squeeze it's some water in this so Did y'all see how I squeezed it in like the, this is crazy. But I, it's some water in this one, so I'm obviously not gonna sell this one. Like this is so weird. I thought it was gonna be easier than this. And I'm trying to figure out like, me trying to clean that machine is so huge. Somebody needs to invent something like a, a self-cleaning lip gloss um, machine because it is fast, but it's very messy and like, wow. I was not expecting this. So I just had to keep it real with y'all and let y'all know like I'm not perfect and I made mistakes too. This is my first time using this machine and trying to get wholesale glosses out there because I know it's what y'all want. So I'm trying my best, but whew, this is really giving me a run for my money, okay? Okay, so I finally ended up filling five eight ounce pouches like I wanted to in the beginning. So here are the five brown skin girl wholesale or ready to be purchased. Okay guys, so I did make my first batch of wholesale lip gloss, which is exciting. But my whole business room now is messy and I never leave it like that. But I'm so hungry. 
So I'm gonna take a lunch break before I continue on and doing what I need to do, which is clean that lip gloss filling machine and clean up in here. So give me one second and I'll be right back after I eat. 15 minutes later. <sighs> You guys, I don't even know where to start. Lip gloss is so sticky. Obviously, I knew that, but like it's so hard to wash. I tried to wash out that bowl. I haven't even tried to wash out the lip gloss film machine yet, and it was a disaster. All of that gloss was getting in the sink. It wasn't going down the drain. It's too sticky. It was getting in my nails, um, all on my hands and stuff, on my clothes. So you know what I think I'm gonna do? I think we're gonna get a kitchen aid, which is the little self mixing thing. And then I'm gonna get some lip gloss jars like um, most people who have wholesale do. I had already had those, so that's why I decided to use these so that they wouldn't go to waste. But if I use these, I'm gonna have to just suck it up and fill them with a syringe until they're gone. Because that lip gloss filling machine is a bit much. Like, yes, I fill those up fast, but to do all of that just for that is like, I don't know if it's worth it. Like, I was really in there scrubbing trying to clean that bowl. Now, obviously I'm gonna have to do the same thing when I clean my, um, oh, let me use that and see if it works. I bought this too. I'm gonna try to wash it one more time. But, um, yeah, that was a lot, y'all. So, anyway, I am uh, tired now. Like, it's like 10 o'clock at night. I was gonna do some more glosses, but I'm really beat. Like, that really got me tired. So, if you guys want to see me make the other glosses um, a different way with the new kitchen aid, let me know and I will do that. But, that is it for today's video and I hope that you enjoyed it. Look forward to the wholesale that is going to be coming soon to Sexy Lexi Inc. It is prop. It will be dropping on my second year business anniversary, which is March 13th. So, I believe that's a Sunday. Maybe I'll do it that Monday or should... No, I think I'll, I'll do it that Sunday. So, yes, the wholesale will be dropping March 13th save the day okay so you can shop 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 and yes if you guys want to see more videos like this more um videos of me making wholesale lip gloss i will do that just let me know i love you guys and i'll see you in my next video bye got the hammer in the ring